Ladies and gentlemen, and eavesdroppers, who may be tuned in on this announcement, the announcer this time was right. He had the names right. This is Bobby Clark speaking of the team of Clark and McCullough, engaged by William Fox for a year of movie tone, making Fox movie tone comedies. By my side is Mr. McCullough, waiting for his cue to address you over the radio. I have forgotten what his cue was, so in case he doesn't address you, you will know the reason. But if you listen closely, you can hear Mr. McCullough breathe. I should say you can hear him wheeze, as he has a touch of asthma. Brought on, no doubt, by these darn fogs. I mean, the golden sunshine of California. How it... However, if Mr. McCullough doesn't speak this afternoon, it won't make any difference, as he is a man of very few words, thereby being ideal for talking pictures. The reason we are one of the first on the program this afternoon is this. In case the others who follow us are no good, you can tune off knowing that you have already had your money's worth. I take great pleasure in presenting to you Mr. McCullough of the team of Clark and McCullough, engaged by William Fox for a year of Fox movie tone comedies. And, uh, Ladies and gentlemen and listeners in, I am happy to be able to attend this dedication. I am happy to be in California. In fact, the only time I ever expect to be any happier than I am today is when I see smoke coming out of all the brewery chimneys. <laughs> My motto has always been, eat, drink, and be merry, for tomorrow there may be a law against it. Pardon me, Mr. McCullough. I'm from the Fox Publicity Department. I have a little list of questions I would like to uh, have you fill out. This is used for magazine and newspaper advertising. Just a few questions about you and about your family. Go ahead and read them. I'll answer them right now. Have you ever done any screen work before? Yes, sir. I used to sip anthracite in the coal yard. That could be called screen work, yes. Is it true that you are a college graduate? And if so, why? I mean, if so, what college? I went to Vassar. Well, that's a girl's college. I know that. Do you think I'm crazy? What was your favorite study in college? I took up medicine. Medicine, eh? Yes, but only the kinds containing alcohol. In what profession was your father? My father was an LLD, large liquor drinker. <laughs> Any other interesting facts about your family or your father? Yes, sir, my father had the lowest forehead of any man in the world. My father could wear an opera hat without opening it. He would have made a very good microphone man. What are your favorite sports? Eating and drinking. To what clubs or fraternities do you belong? I belong to that famous organization known as the Moochers. You mean the Munchers. It's the same thing, of course. Well, that'll be all. Thank you, Mrs. McCullough. That's enough. This, this is Bobby Clark again. What a wonderful affair this is, and what a wonderful program you're going to hear this afternoon. So don't turn off. We've just been kidding. We're asked to fill in a few minutes while a regular radio speaker gets here. So just keep on listening in. Thank you very much.